Tiger Lily Squad, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's Hey, hey, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's Hey, hey, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? Hey, Tiger Lily Squad, gang gang, what up? Before we get into this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe turn on all your post notification bells so you can stay up to date with any videos that i post don't forget to follow me on all social media platforms at essence of shay and um what else sign up for my newsletter at www.essenceofshay.com i do have an amazing relaunch happening soon on the store but i have some dope content over there as well so in this video we are continuing with the series getting my locks back to its glory don't worry about how i look right now you guys know i did my hair about two three weeks ago at a salon um yesterday was supposed to be a wash day but I got so hectic. So watch it is coming next, not this video. But in this video, I would like to speak about the importance of scalp massaging. This is critical in healthy hair, scalp and growth. So let me put my hair down first and foremost. This is my hair after I've come out the shower, after I've worked out, after it all. This is it, this is her sis, this is her. The edges are not done, it, it just, it just it, you know, it is what it is. So I'm gonna bring my hair all the way to the front. So, scalp massaging, a lot of people do it and they never know like why they're doing it they just do it because they know it feel good so that's the number one benefit in this whole thing is that it just feels good and it's just calming and soothing so what i tend to do these are my steps when i am massaging my hair i do this every single day um So we will be start. Thank God the AC turned off. Like sis, she always want to come on when I'm recording with y'all. Like she just want to be in everybody's business. We hear you, sis. We hear you. Thank you. But first of all, I'm going to uh, moisturize my hair. So we all know moisture does not come from oil. It comes from a water soluble. So this is my lavender hair spritz that I will be um, using. This is the new and improved uh, recipe. I told y'all, new launch coming. But um, I still have a few of the old recipes, which are still good on the website that you can purchase if you choose to. So just gonna moisturize my lock, moisturize my roots. moisturize that there so benefits of scalp massaging so it decreases migraines right if you suffer from migraines migraines migraine why can't I talk if you suffer from migraines scalp massaging head massaging in general um, helps with that it also helps calm headaches um, when you use essential oils. Um, the aroma from the essential oil make it, makes it calming and soothing to the brain. So that releases a calm with your headaches. But you guys are not here for just that part, right? So then there's two types of massage, hand massages you can do. You can do the hands, leave it up to your little digits. They have not done you wrong this whole time. Um, and just like small circular motions. You guys see me do this all the time and I'm always in heaven. Just, just go at it. Scalp 
massaging also stimulates the nerves on your head. Um, it exercises the scalp and stimulates blood circulation, which ultimately promotes hair growth. See? See. All right. So then I want to seal in all that moisture, so I'm going to use my cover oil. This is the travel size. Um, I don't have it up. I think I have it up on the site, but I, if not, it's coming soon. But this is a travel size. Um, there's some herb and stuff in there that's good for healthy scalp, healthy hair growth, and all that stuff. I'm just going to place that on my scalp. Um, uh, massaging your scalp also strengthens the roots and prevents baldness. Well, it says it prevents baldness. There's no scientific fact of that yet. I just used the rest of my oil. <laughs> so I'm going to use my hand again and just small circular motions. Massaging your scalp also lowers stress levels. So you might be thinking, what the heck does that have to do with hair growth, Shay? I am an advocate when I say stress causes hair loss. Stress causes hair loss. Don't forget to get your edges, queen, and don't go too hard. Nice and gentle, circular motions will do the trick, okay? Cool thing about the scalp massaging is it can be used when shampooing your hair to help just lift up the dirt even more and get that scalp really clean. But it's also beneficial if you do a scalp massage before your hair washing. It helps loosen up the follicles and it makes you get a deeper, deeper cleanse. The second way to do a scalp massage is with a scalp massager, duh, which is a tool. So I have the Vita Goods one a bunch of stuff on it because I had it all over the floor but we're not gonna judge I have this the white one you see the bristles there's a button right on the side that turns it on and you just place it on the top of your head and the vibration of it not only feels good but this is stimulating the blood circulate helping the blood circulate through your hair um, I would suggest doing these doing a scalp massage 15 minutes a day um so you can hear it, right so i like to start in the center and i'll just place it right there and just small circles oh that feels so good it gets deeper than your fingers so if you don't want to purchase this quite all right it's not a necessity but it does help you just get a deeper massage but listen your fingers could do the same thing this thing feels so damn good sheesh do anything 15 minutes your hands will get tired but that's why you're supposed to be doing the workout challenges with me, sis. So you could get that upper body strength, sissy. Mm. Uh, crash course. Let me have the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the